newbie, I've assigned you a driver for your next job. Meet us at the rendezvous. I'll be right there. Where is everyone? I didn't need everyone. Just you. Because I'm the only one who could get it done. Sure, let's go with that. Sergio, huh? You're familiar with Panteros? I mean, my roommate's one of them, so yeah. Oh, don't give me that look. Rent's expensive. Is this gonna be a problem? I mean, per the roommate code, I'm gonna have to fold her laundry for two weeks, but beyond that, I'm golden. Where are they moving? Antiquities, mostly. The Nawali was waiting to sync up with them before he was captured. You mean before we captured him? I'm pretty sure you were about to die when I came along and saved your ass. And yet, if I hadn't stalled him, he would have got away. So, you're welcome. Do you want it to look like an accident or a statement? What? Well, I'm assuming you want me to make the convoy disappear. No, I want you to follow it. So I can kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. So we know where they're going. Sure, and then I kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. No, then you will report back to me, I will arrive with the team, and you will go home and hit the showers before you have a chance to fuck it up. You think I can't do this? I think you like getting a paycheck. Follow the convoy. Don't fuck it up. JR, we about to see some action? Nope. Orders are to follow the convoy, observe its activity, and report back. Seriously? The convoy's right there. You know, I heard about you. I'm a little bit of a maverick myself. Two crazy badasses like us, we're not gonna mix it up? No. My friends are counting on me to get my performance bonus. I can't afford to screw it up. We don't engage, just observe and report. Looks like them motorcycles are falling back. Probably just drop something. You gonna just let him shoot at us? When was very clear on not engaging. We don't do something. All we're gonna observe and report is getting dead. Fine, just this one. <laughs> That's how I like to ride. Oh, 
Okay, back on track. From now on, observe and report. Oh, fuck, they have a turret. Can't take this kind of fire forever. Our orders are to follow them. No can do. Unless you want to take that thing out. I... God damn it, get in closer. Wait, what are you doing? Taking out the turret. From the roof? No, from the truck. Get closer. You're out of your goddamn mind. I thought you said you were a maverick. A little bit. I said a little bit. and get back on tap. Oh! Heads up! You got more incoming. Ah, oh, come on. I was almost done. Well, as long as I'm here. Ugh. Ruby, why am I seeing gunfire at the back of that convoy? When? Well, there were motorcycles and then a turret and one thing led to another. Well, that was different. You don't sound mad. Did you honestly think I would send one car after a convoy that size? You're just a distraction. We got a drone following these motherfuckers. Wait, you use me as bait? That's the job you were born for. Mission accomplished. Now finish what you're doing and get out of here. They are. Pick me up. I can't get close. That truck's on fire. Shit. Ah, the car's on fire. <laughs> That's right. Kill that some bitch. Okay, time to finally get the fuck out of. What is that? Sandstorm. We're going in. Come in, newbie. Gwen, we hear you. We're falling back. Negative. The drone is down. I need. Need eyes on that convoy. I'm giving you field command. Fuck, really? Do what you gotta do. Follow the lead truck until it stops. Then radio. Jr. Let's get him. Kid gloves are off. The kid gloves were on? Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh, I can't get a clear shot. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. 
Convoy ahead. Uh, we got a problem here. Be more specific. Sand's clogging up my intake. We're losing speed. Great. Just give me into jumping range and fall back. That's suicide. I got us this far, didn't I? I don't want to be a maverick no more. You can't take all of us. Motherfucker. We'll bury you out here. Ah. Oh. What do you think you're dealing with? Ooh. Fuck you, you Pantera fuck.
Penguin. I followed the convoy. It, uh... It stopped. You did good. Holy shit, a compliment. Yeah, yeah. Stay here. Newbie, get over here. Now! Gwen says you were responsible for retrieving the Hummingbird Codex. If that was something in the truck, then yes. Impressive work. I wouldn't have been able to do it without JR, sir. Team player. I like that. There's someone I'd like you to meet. This is Dr. Antonio Espina. He's the chief curator for the Museum of Santo Aliso. It's nice to meet you, sir. The retrieval of these relics is no small feat. The museum is in Marshall's debt. Just doing my job, sir. Antonio's museum has a contract with Marshall, and he requested you to be in charge of security. What? Gwen's filled me in on your eccentricities, but the results speak for themselves. Sir, it's my second day. Sounds like someone wants to talk themselves out of a promotion. No, no, I want the job. I'm just surprised. Things change fast here at Marshall. So, can Antonio and I count on you or not? Yes, sir. Good thing I brought a wingsuit. Get this shit moving. It's me, JR, from Marshall. I got a favor to ask if you got a minute. I'd be a little some minute for you, too. Yeah, I'm not doing anything else. Be right there.
Just leave the keys. I'm too rich to die. Hey, JR. What's up? Well, after that little clusterfuck we had with the Panteros, you know, when my life was flashing before my eyes, I started thinking about early retirement. Seems fair. Took my bonus and savings and bought this empty lot. I'm fixing to open my own garage. Trouble is, a pack of those idols anarchists made off on my shipment of car parts. Without it, my garage is gonna fail before it even opens. And you want me to get the shipment back? After our last run, I figure this should be easy. I'd make it worth your while. Say, a percentage of the garage? A percentage? I'm in. Hey, yo. Kev, quick question. The idols robbed this guy I know. Any idea where they take his stuff? Probably to the camp. This friend of yours some rich bigwig? Nope. Just a regular Joe trying to make ends meet. That doesn't sound right. The idols are about taking down the corrupt system, not the little guy. Yeah, and they never get overzealous. Well, just be careful, okay? The idols are like a family to me. I promise I'll be nice to them. That must be the camp. really know how to throw a party. Who the hell are you? I'm, uh, looking to join. You. Idols. A new recruit? Well, come on in. Go find Cheryl, with a snake mask. She'll hook you up. You want to be one of us? You gotta wear a pink. Hi, Cheryl? I'm thinking about joining the Idols. Yeah! Ready to take down the establishment? Sure. By, like, stealing car parts and shit? Or by punching everybody in the neck till they choke! <laughs> but hey, you do you. The Idols are a big tent. You like heists? Talk to Martin. He's headbanging around somewhere. You 
Martin? Heard you were a heist man. Fuck yeah! I made this botnet that hacks Wi-Fi-enabled refrigerators. Come summer, there won't be a working ice dispenser in town. Sounds great for the little guy. But do you steal real things? Like car parts? What even is real in a late-stage capitalist digital economy? Boom. Mind blown. But if you like meat space theft, talk to Timmy O. He's around somewhere working on his bike. Timmy O, I heard you bring in big hauls. Anything that ain't nailed down. Just boosted a shipment of car parts off some cog in the big auto machine. Crazy! Where would you even keep something like that? Warehouse and back, with the other refuse of materialism. Cold Kev, I try to play nice. Stop! What are you doing here? I heard you have some car parts I was hoping to take back. Fuck off. Thing is, they belong to one of the little guys you say you fight for, so... There are no little guys. Just idols and tools of the system. Have to tether that container and drag it back to JR.
Holy shit, you actually did it. Now I can finally build my garage. I always deliver on a job. Hang on. Kev, what's up? You said you'd be nice to them. I was. They were shitheads. Well, now they want you dead, and they're headed your way. Shit. Thanks for the heads up. JR, we got idols coming. Those some bitches are back. Time to beat some asses. That's over. Thanks for saving my business. No problem. Thanks for the percentage. Now all I need to do is build a garage. How's that gonna work? Just you watch. Here it is. The world premiere grand opening at Jim Rob's Garage. The service center has all the tools you need to customize your ride. And if you see a car out there with something you like, bring it on in. Now that we're in business, let's talk shop. JR, if we're short on parts, why don't we just steal them? We could run a little chop shop here. Now that would save us a pretty penny. I need some parts for a hammerhead. How about you get me one of those? to drive this over to Jim Rob's. Do not! Jim Rob's. Hey, JR. I got you a hammerhead. All right. Just leave it there on the side. What else you need? The idols have an off-road buggy they call the Desert Devil. Can you get that for me? I've seen them riding northeast of town around the mesas. If it's out there, I'll find it. Mom and Dad's good boyfriend. Carl seems nice.
about to start for the Hummingbird Codex unveiling. I want your security team in place. It's your night to shine. Bingo! Team, tonight's a big night, so nobody fuck it up. You, uh, Johnson, is the codex ready for its entrance? Roger that. It's in position, and the display case hover tech is green. Good. I love this tech. Thank you for coming here this I'm gonna check in with the boss. We Antonio's speech should be wrapping up. You join us for this very Bravo, team. How's it hanging? Uh, fine. The Hummingbird Codex holds a I saw that. Just kidding. Relax. 30 years ago, and of course, I was a young thanks to each and every one of you, Mexico City. your donations tonight will benefit the international effort to end illegal traffic of stolen antiquities. Mr. Marshall, how was your evening, sir? Fine, fine. But I don't see our guest of honor. Where's my Hummingbird Codex? They'll be escorting it in any moment. That's what I like to hear. Have you met Myra Starr? 
She's on the Marshall Board of Directors. How do you do, ma'am? Quite well. So, you're Atticus's new hotshot. That's what it says on my ID badge. Oh, talented and confident. Reminds me of a younger me. Now, what say we celebrate? Go get yourself a drink. Yes, sir. Antonio was in fine form, wasn't he? We decided to go solar for our beach house. What do you think you're doing? You don't drink on duty. I'm following orders. Atticus told me to celebrate. <laughs> of course he did. You want a word of advice? Watch your step around Atticus. He only sees results. No problem. That's what I give him. Uh-huh. Hey, what happened to not drinking on duty? I'm not on duty. Hey, Nina, I can't talk. I'm working security. That's why I'm calling. Los Panteros are about to try to take the Codex back. What? Are you sure? Yes, I'm driving getaway. I'd have called sooner, but I wasn't alone. Fuck. When? Nina, get off your phone. We're going in. Shit. Under control. You glad you had that drink now? Maybe. This is Sergio. Panteros. Bring me the codex. Everyone else, stay the fuck out of my way. Ah, shit balls. Este evento es una farsa construida sobre la apropiación cultural de los artefactos. I can handle this. Oh. This will snap. We got a security breach. Panteros are in the Paleolithic exhibit. Panteros on level three. Increase the guard on the codex. Right here, Mr. Marshall. Get this under control. It's an embarrassment to the company. Yes, sir. Oh. Oh. Secure the codex. I'll get Atticus out of here. Hey, I'm in charge here. You get Atticus out of here, I'll secure the codex. Uh-huh. Get eyes on the codex. You nuts! That place is full of Panteros! It's faster. I can handle them. Fear 
Idols too? Thanks for the heads up, Kev. What happened to the roommate code? That went well. What a fine monument to greed you build. The oppressors drink and laugh while the enslaved clean up their table scraps. Your so-called society is a failed experiment. It's time to put it to an end. Time to wash it away. Time to make some noise. Get ready for a whole new world with no pharaohs, no gods, no idols, but us. Got him. Damn it, the idols are here too! There's too many of them! We lost Perkins! Come with me if you want to stay alive. Got him. We need backup! The idols are everywhere! Jesus Christ, these psychos keep coming! Guess I won. I'm almost at the codex. Anyone got eyes on it? The idols are in the codex room. I'm trying to. Attention, value guests. Oh! Away from there. the rest of the board. I'll get the codex to the safe room. How the fuck do I move it? Your martial ID triggers the sensor. It'll move on its own as long as you stay close. Got it. Access granted. Emergency transport initiated. Hover systems re-engaging.
safety protocol. <laughs> Waiting for escort. Get that one. Approaching the safe room. I need backup. This thing is getting buggy. I'll kill you some other time. Cover systems re-engaging. The Codex is still up there. Fucking hover tech. Somebody report. I got separated from the Codex. Anyone have eyes on it? Negative. I got nothing. It's just chaos here. Damn it. The door is blocked. Need something to bust through that gate. Gunpowder? Replica. Damn it. Cool cannon. Busted RPG? No fixing that. Rocket! Need something to fire it with. I have an idea. Shit, that worked. Sergio? Let's go, motherfucker! Yeah! When? When? Go! You fucking pastel! We fight as one! This is a cannon of truth!
Snap out of it. I need a meat shield. Ooh. That is one big asshole. Gwen, you're alive. Don't celebrate yet. Sergio got away. I got most of the board locked down, but I can't find my restore. Stop it. Keep an eye out for it. That went well. those bootstraps and pick yourself up. It's you. Better find cover. I'll hold them off. You can come out, Miss Star. It's safe. Thank you. Thank you so much. You are really good at this. It's not my first time shooting up a place with a minigun, ma'am. Just the first time people are happy I did it. How the fuck did this happen? Shit. What's going on, sir? You. Sir, I know I made a little mess protecting the museum, but we have to look at the big picture. The threat's been neutralized, Mistar is safe, and, as you can see, the Codex is secure. A mess? Yes, there is a goddamn mess! I don't... I don't understand. Well, you were wasting time with her. The idol stole the Codex and replaced it with a fake! Sir, I wasn't wasting time. I was saving... Do you think I give a shit if Myra Star lives or dies? Atticus. You are replaceable. You are replaceable. That was not. Sir, I can lead a team to retrieve the Codex. The hell you can. You're fired. What? You're done. If I see you on Marshall property again, I'll have you shot. We'll make this right, Antonio. I promise. Thank you. I am sorry. I just got word that the idols are planning on attacking the museum. Hey, it's Kev. I, uh, I made your breakfast if you want some. That's cool if you don't. Nina wasn't hungry either. 
Uh, uh. I'm sorry about last night. I didn't hear about the museum until it was too late to warn you. The Collective don't tell me shit. You should come to the Idols party with Eli and I later. Open bar? No? Mm. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go. Just, uh... Just know that Eli and I are worried about you guys. Later. Well, looks like we both got fucked over. Yeah. No work today? I'm leaving Sergio's group text on red. Fair. Los Panteros have been going downhill since he started leading. We used to be about family. Now it's all about him. Plus, he's zero for two this week, and that just makes him pissy. I want to eat my feelings. Oh, come the fuck on. God damn it. Stupid refurbished appliances. Figures. Welcome back to the Cutting Room, the premier auction experience for knife connoisseurs of all ages. Our first stop, Lung Piercer, a contemporary update on the classic Shiv, the Lung Piercer. Looks like we got a shopper in Santa Aliso that knows their stabbing implements. Let's bring out the next item. It's been a hell of a day here on the Cutting Room, but I've been saving the best for last. The Judas 3000. If Brutus had had one of these bad boys, he wouldn't have needed the Senate to help stab Caesar. How many knives did you end up buying? Not enough. Hey, Sergio just texted us. <sighs> he has to be pretty pissed. Yeah, says he's planning on attacking the idols party. Man, I'd hate to be the idols right now. Everyone at that party is probably gonna get killed. Sucks to be Kevin Eli. Yeah. Oh shit! We gotta go. They're not coming, are they? They'll get over it, man. Don't worry about it. <sighs> They're totally pissed at me. They'll get over it. Give them time. You mind if I get a drink? You do you, man. Can I have a white wine spritzer? Eli, are you okay? I, I, I don't think so. Get in and drive fast. Where's the party? The resort. We gotta move. Try to get a hold of Eli. I'm gonna call Kev. Come on, come on, come on. You picking up? Nothing. You? Yo, no. this is Fuck. Kevin. We got voicemail. Same so here. Leave a message after I drop the beat. Wait for it. Wait for it. Kev, call me. 
I'm gonna call Sergio. Maybe I can put a stop to this. He'll never listen. It's worth a try. Sergio, you gotta call this off. My friends are in there. I'm the friend you should be worried about. You are taking Los Panteros to war just because you think Marshall and the Idols embarrassed you. You're saying some shit you're gonna regret, Nina. Call it off or I quit. You ain't gonna quit. Try me. Calling. Kev's calling. Put it on speaker. Kev, you all right? I'm fine, but Eli... They fucking shot me! You're doing great, Eli. Stay cool. Where are you guys? Eli's behind the bar. I'm keeping him covered. Nina and I are on our way. Keep Eli alive. Got it. Please don't hang up! Eli, listen to me. Nina and I are gonna kill every motherfucker standing between us and you. And that means we're gonna need both hands, okay? Okay. You're gonna be fine. I promise. The Panteros group chat is blowing up. They set up roadblocks on the bridges. We're gonna have to go through your crew, Nina. Los Panteros aren't my crew anymore. Eli and Kev are all that matters. You ready? Let's get our boys back home. Perfect. Oh, Nina! She's turned on us! No! Los Panteros turned on me! They're here. We're gonna get you out, but you'll have to walk. Oh. I'll try. Shit. Shit? Shit what? What now? Los Panteros should have left the party crashing to the experts. Looks like you're gonna back the fuck off. No, 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 no! They're cool, they're with me. If they're with you, then you get to kill them.
Guess this is my last night at party. You don't need this fucking cult anyway. What she said. Let's finish what you started and get Eli out of here. Yes, please. Johnny, you are getting out of here. Not one piece. Okay. Eli, let's go. Oh man, we're in the shit now. We just pissed off the idols and Los Panteros. Yeah, big time. So let's not stick around until they come back. Agreed, let's move. And this time I'm driving. That truck. Better acceleration. Oh, what about the gas mileage? Fuck the gas mileage! I'm good. Panteros are coming after us. That's it. I've had enough for one day. Keep driving. I'm gonna teach these fuckers a lesson. You sure? We got them coming up fast. Well, I got an RPG and some shit to work out. So let's see how that goes for them. That's right. I don't wanna die before I make my first million. You're not gonna die. I got you, buddy. So much blood. Play Eli's audiobook. It always calms him down. Do I have it in Oh, not this again. Hey, I can use some positivity right now. Turn it up. You have more APC and power than the world wants you to know. But for real, <laughs> Neil, just give me one second. <laughs> your own boss. <laughs> Of your happiness, of your life. Get that one. Now, now, you're selling hours of your life away for fifteen bucks a piece. So what do I say to the person who wants to get paid what they deserve? Oh. Fuck! This thing corners like a boat. Oh. Every turn makes the hurt worse. Be with us, Eli. Life We're almost out of this. Perfect. But if you want to learn from your mistakes oh. instead of getting punished with someone else's, what are you gonna do? No. Oh. These fuckers are relentless. I know how to lose a brain. You deserve better. You deserve better. You are more than a cog in a corporate machine. You are Time not out. defined by your stupid death or on. your useless degree. If your life is stuck in neutral, there's only one place to play. Uh, Nina? Not now. Damn, nice job. Never doubt me. Let's get Eli somewhere safe. But only... Weren't we 
me at the hospital. Because you don't have insurance. I don't really care. And what if you saw what they charged to fix a flesh wound? Kev, where's the... Hall closet, Yo, Kev. top shelf. Okay, this is gonna suck, buddy. Oh, fuck! You're doing great. You're being very brave. Fuck you. Hey, keep talking to Kev like that, and you won't get a star on the star chart. <laughs> Ow! Oh, what are we gonna do? Finish sewing you up? Yeah, and then what? The idols and Panteros aren't exactly our number one fans right now. Isn't that obvious? We're starting a criminal empire. What? Your car was right, Eli. About everything. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? Guys, we're really good at what we do. So why are we doing it for other people and not ourselves? I mean, you know how to start a business. Kev knows how to get attention. <laughs> I'm a walking murder party, and Nina? Nina's the best goddamn driver in the business. Who could touch us? Hell, we just took on two crews at once and walked away just fine. I was shot. And you're getting a sticker, so quit bitching. I'm in. Fuck yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Eli? Guys, this is a little crazy. What happened to there being a difference between surviving and thriving? Well, I survived being shot, and now I want to thrive without being shot again. Nina's down. Kev's down. Snickerdoodle is definitely down. Oh, do not bring her into this. Eli, this cat suffers no fools. And neither should you. Uh. Is that a yes? Yeah, it's a yes. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started.